number of hunky shirtless dancers. Uh, a big eight. A big eight. Eight tens, let's put it that way. Eight, yeah, absolutely. Or twelves even. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But who's counting? So at this moment, how great a time is it to be Shania Twain? It's, this is a fabulous time in my life, personally. I'm more creative than I've been in years, like a lot, I think since probably The Woman in Me, mm. that whole writing period. I'm, I'm writing every day, I've got a little studio in my house, I, I've been designing clothes, and I mean obviously very much into that for the show playing with fabrics and just getting giddy and inspi being inspired by creativity. What does a day in the life of Shania Twain look like in Vegas when you're not on stage? In the morning, I mean a routine for, I'm very, like, I'm very much a homebody so I like to stay at home, I'll be with my dogs. I First thing I do is get up and go feed the horses and, and turn them out and and I'll ride and uh, groom. Spend a lot of time out there. I love being out with the horses. And, or, you know, time with friends. I go to shows. So by the time evening comes around, I, you know, I quickly get out of my riding stuff and drive to the strip, even though I'm not <laughs> working that night, and watch shows or go to dinner and enjoy, you know, the, the, the strip side of Vegas, which I love as a, as a, as a fan, as a visitor. I'd love to see people just bumping into you on the strip and be like, what, should I? <laughs> We've heard rumors about collabs with Post Malone, Harry Styles, Janelle Monet, Lizzo. Any yeah. truth to any of that? Yes, I'm pursuing them, those uh, dreams. I, I'm a fan of all of these people. Uh -huh. And, and you know, we're, it's a mutual thing. I'm in such a creative space right now writing, so I'm just, focusing on writing songs for us and we'll find the right moments and songs to uh, to get in the studio and do something together. There seems to be a mutual love, um, especially in Vegas in the community. I saw AJ McLean in the audience last night, David Copperfield, uh, um, cast of Vanderpump Rules. Yeah. You know, is that a special uh, an energy that's exclusive to Vegas, that kind of supporting each other and just, or just everybody's just really fans of each other? Very much so. I really love that about Las Vegas. There's a community here. There's there's not just a community of performers, but there certainly is that. The, the, the entertainers do support each other. They share ideas. They're not secretive about things. They, I don't sense a, a competitiveness among us. Like, I, I think it's rare to Las Vegas. Mm -hmm. We all want each other to do well. We want what's best for the town. The town is a platform that is a privilege for us. Only the best are here. And if you're in a residency scenario, like a long-term thing like what I'm doing, or any of these shows are doing, that is, that is the biggest privilege you could ever get or have. We feel privileged to be a part of it. It's so incredible. I feel very at home here and I, I never want to leave now. 